So for hip range of motion here, we can do just some passive stuff. I'm going to have you relax here, Luke. We're going to go into flexion. And with this, a bad kind of stretch would be one in which they felt it in the front of their hip. So when we go up like this, the restriction, go ahead and relax, Luke. The restriction should be felt more in the posterior hip compartment. And then from here we can do, if they are feeling um, irritation in the front, we can pull that joint capsule away by eliciting the hip flexor muscles. So Luke, don't let me move you. There you go. And relax. And then don't let me move you. Good. And that will free it up sometimes. Sometimes it doesn't, and we use the mobilization belt. We have some internal rotation. And again, we can do contract, relax, don't let me move you. Good. Excuse me, this is external rotation. And relax. I missed that one on a test before. I remember that in PT school. And then, yeah, see, I messed it up again. This is external rotation. It's like P's and B's. Internal, external. Yeah, don't let me move you. Excellent. So just kind of some warm-up stuff there. We can do long axis distraction from there as well. Like that. We can inhibit the iliacus, which I don't even want to think about how ticklish you're going to be. Try to tough it out here. So from this position, we're going to go in and inhibit this. You will probably never encounter a patient quite this ticklish. So if they do that, um, that would not be a good technique for them. That's something that they could work on at home versus your clinic because they're just going to kick you. No, you're, you're fine. So now I'm going to do some, some joint mobilizations here. I'm going to put this around my waist, cinch it up, and we're going to do a little bit of distraction here. As we're doing the distraction, we can combine that with a little bit of hip flexion. And you can see how I'm, I'm leaning away distracting that hip, we can combine that with a little bit of rotation, but be careful with that. You can do a little lateral glide from there. So those are hip joint mobilizations. There's others, but those are the ones that I like to use the best. I got myself kind of tied up there. Thank you. So hip range of motion.